Obasanjo finally reveals why he wrote controversial letter to Buhari. Former President Olusegun Obasanjo has revealed why he wrote an open letter to President Buhari. He said the letter was not written out of malice to the President. Obasanjo also noted that he never condemned the Buhari led administration in totality. Former President Olusegun Obasanjo has said that his recent open letter to President Muhammad Buhari was not born out malice or bad bell but out of his deep concern for the situation in the country. Reports that he said this on Thursday, February 1, at the Secretariat of the Nigeria Union of Journalists, Ogilwo area of Abiyo Kuta, shortly after the Coalition for Nigeria movement was inaugurated in Ogun State, and he was registered as a member of the movement after formally filling the registration form. It was gathered that Obasanjo's registration came almost 24 hours after the CNM was inaugurated in Abuja. Obasanjo arrived the venue at exactly 12.44 p.m. in company with former governors of Cross River and Asun states, Donald Duke and Prince Olagunsoy Oyunlola respectively, among others. The former president while addressing scores of potential members who had gathered at the venue, said he was surprised that many Nigerians were worried that he had exchanged pleasantries with President Buhari at the African Unity Summit at Addis Ababa, capital of Ethiopia, few days after he wrote the open letter to him, Buhari. He noted that he never condemned the Buhari-led administration in totality, as he explained he gave him commendation in areas where it had performed well. Obasanjo, however, spoke in parable, hinting that big masquerades have taken the center stage, and the small masquerades must quit the stage. He said, Last week, I issued a statement which I did not do lightly or frivolously but out of deep concern for the situation of our country. I wonder why some Nigerians were worried why I had to pay respect to the Nigerian president at Addis Ababa. That's my own upbringing as a well-born and bred Yoruba boy. That doesn't mean that what I have said about the president, which I did not say out of bitterness and hatred, it is evident that the president has performed in some areas, good enough. In other areas not good and a proper advice which he may take and he may not take. I didn't do that out of malice or out of bad bell, I did it out of my respect for that office and my interest and I hope in your interest and the interest of Buhari in Nigeria. Meanwhile, it had previously reported that more top politicians in the country have reacted to former President Olusegun Obasanjo's letter to President Muhammad Buhari criticizing his administration and asking him not to seek re-election in the 2019 elections. In a letter to the President, Obasanjo noted some of the area where the Buhari administration has failed to deliver and said it was best for him not to contest in 2019. Meanwhile Obasanjo officially registers with CNM hoping to sack Buhari in 2019. Former President Olusegun Obasanjo on Thursday officially registered with the Coalition for Nigeria Movement, CNM. Obasanjo had in his recent letter asking Muhammad Buhari to go home and rest and not seek re-election in 2019, suggested CNM as a new non-partisan movement that will ensure Buhari's All Progressives Congress, APC and the opposition People's Democratic Party, PDP, are voted out in 2019. The movement was on Wednesday launched in Abuja at the Yaradua Center, Abuja. On Thursday, former PDP governors of Asun and Cross River states, Olagunsoy Oyunlola and Donald Duke respectively, were in attendance at the Secretariat of the Nigeria Union of Journalists, NUJ, Okilwo Abio Kuta, where Obasanjo did his registration. They had both also attended, and spoke during the inauguration of the group in Abuja, Obasanjo noted that he will leave the group if it becomes partisan, even as he predicted that CNM will emerge victorious in 2019. Oyanola had also, while speaking during the launching of the group in Abuja, maintained that the group is not a political party, at least for the moment. Also speaking in the same vein, Obasanjo explained that the newly formed CNM, is a pressure group for good governance. Some people have started worrying about the problem of personalities, in which some, in other efforts, allocate positions to themselves. This movement is not about personality or personalities, but about platform and system. Our system so far has not given us what we must have. For the first time, we are building a platform from bottom up. The movement's base is the grassroots and the people all the people. 
it is necessary to make it clear that this movement does not regard itself as a third force. It sees itself as a popular movement that can accommodate all Nigerians irrespective of their political interest or affiliations and will propel Nigeria forward.